All right, what we have to do is translate triangle ABC positive 7 in the x direction and negative 8 in the y direction. Now the x direction just means left to right because our x-axis goes left and right. And the y direction just means up or down because the y-axis is going up and down. So a positive 7 movement in the x direction just means move 7 to the right. And negative 8 in the y direction just means moving down 8. So what we're going to do first is record the current coordinates of point A, which are currently negative 7 and positive 7. Now, all we really need to do to figure out the new location of each point into translation is take each change in the x direction and apply it to our x values, and take the given change in the y direction and apply that to the y values. So what we're going to do is add 7 to our x value, and we are going to subtract 8 to our y value. So if we combine these x values here, these are opposite integers, so that results in 0. 7 minus 8 results in negative 1. So this will be where the a point is going to be translated to. All right, let's take a look at point b, which is currently located at negative 2, positive 3. So once again, to figure out the new location of b, we're going to add 7 to the x and subtract 8 from the y. Negative 2 and positive 7 is positive 5. 3 and negative 8 results in negative 5. All right, currently C is located at negative 8, positive 1. So let us go ahead and record those coordinates. And to figure out where C is going to end up, what we do is we add 7 to the x value and we subtract 8 from the y value. Negative 8 and positive 7 results in negative 1. Positive 1 and negative 8 results in negative 7. All right, so all you really have to do with the translation is just take the change in the x direction and apply that change to all of the x values and take the change in the y direction and apply that number to all of the y values.